All right, so Jolene from Ride the Wind E-Bikes, we're really excited. We've got the Connect here. This is my first impression video. It's little. It's so cute. <laughs> it's so little. We'll do a comparison beside the Cruise and the uh, Nexa, but it, it, it's cute. It's little. So it's only 40 inches across. I'm five foot three. And so look, that's like 49 inches high and it's about 90 inches long. Um, it is quite little, uh, so just keep that in mind with like me, my size, uh, if you're looking at one of these, if you're six foot, it's actually not bad because the seat goes back, but this is what needed to happen. A better interior, a much nicer interior, power windows, power locks. Uh, and you can order these with AC. Here, let's take a look at the inside. Um, I guess it's got like a nice little storage here. This seat is not very wide. <laughs> it's only 15 inches, 16 inches wide. My butt's, uh, as you can see, hanging off the side there. That's okay. All right, so let's turn our fan on. Okay, so it's just got low or high. Cool. Let's try the AC. I hear it come on. I feel cool air. I'd say that's the same as the Nexa. Oh, this must be the, this, let, let's see this. Is this the heat? It's, that's defrost though. That's your, that's your here. Okay, we're going to have to ask about that because I'm not feeling heat from here. That's your defrost there. Oh, that's heat. Okay, so the heat seems to, right? This is my first impression, guys, so I'm not, not an expert. Okay, so the heat only comes from the front, and uh, it's nice and warm. I got to say that's nice. Again, these always take a little longer to heat up or cool down. Okay, so lights... Uh, daylight, nighttime, signals, high beam. Yeah, high beam, night light, day running off. Okay, on this side, we've got low. There we go. High, low, decent span goes from edge to edge, off. Oh, myth. Okay. We've got, we've got fluid. I'm not sure where that goes yet. We'll have to see if we can get into the hood. And then I'll, um, okay, so let's go to the touch screen. So they put this on here, so to protect it from the sun. Um, it definitely does have glare off of like my white shirt, but the most important is we've got the voltage. We always wanna know what the voltage is. This is a 60 volt system, fully charged. This will be 72 to 74 volts. And see right here, it's showing that it's 100%, but it's not. We'll go over that in another video. But we always make mention in all of ours that you must look at the voltage. Always, always, always. Okay, so fog lamps are here. So you've got your USB here. Plug in your phone. Drive, neutral, reverse. I don't know what that is because I don't see a light. But uh, it does not have a reverse sound. Uh, but it does have a backup camera so that's pretty cool that helps yeah it's hard to see in the video because there's so much reflection for me at least we got some sun today okay so we'll put it back into drive now is this touch screen oh horn horn works oh yeah it's touch screen okay excellent oh you do need to look pretty close for this listen nothing's ever perfect but we're getting through there's the home Bluetooth. Yeah. So we'll do that in another video too, how to connect the Bluetooth because I'm not seeing that right now. Volume though, like how do I get to my volume? There's the radio. Oh, there we are. There we go. Okay, so I'm just touching that it's going down. Oh, there's the volume right here. 
volume off, volume on, okay? Oh. I found it, I found it. That takes a, quite a bit of effort. You're not gonna be doing that while you're driving. That's for sure. Yeah, that's, that's just, that's, you set your, your sound, but then you can reach and, and mute it very easily. That's easy. Okay, I wonder what eco is. I'll we'll have to figure that out. Four ways, let's see what the four ways look like in the fog lamps. Oh, it signals, that's cool. These could be a little bit bigger, like the signal lights there. Let's see if we can see the lights at night, or light, nights, lights during the day. Blah. Do you see a difference? Okay, so that's high beam. Cool lighting. I want to see what those... Okay, so daylight running, uh, night, high beam. Uh, and I don't see fog lamps. Now, guess what's really annoying about this? If you are not uh, seated in the seat, it beeps at you. It's not really loud, but, um, uh, but it's there. Doors shut pretty good. They're not double sealed, but they definitely have a perfect close. There's no gaps at all on either side. I like that. But they've got a good sound. It's all flat. That's good. So the back window will open and the sunroof opens as well. That's a nice mechanism. That's the same as the next. So that's good. Now let's do this test. Okay. That's what we're talking about. That's what we're talking about. <laughs> yeah, so it's very exciting because they have upgraded suspension. Well done, Ecolo, from the cruise to the Connect, although it's a little bit smaller. That's the kind of suspension. Double wishbone is not, it's not sturdy. It's not going to handle in corners. So you've got struts under here. Yep. And it's pretty covered underneath, actually. It's got some plating underneath. But look how low this is. This is cool. All right. Oh, and then the charging port's at the back. I don't know how to get that open yet. So your charging port is at the back, which they all are here. Oh, I like the lights across the back. There you go. Okay, first impression. Cool. Cool, cool, cool.